Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, doing some PvP with, you guessed it, the Burial Blade. We got a curb sword and a big giant scythe. Overall, I gotta say, this is a very good weapon. With the range and the attacks, if you practice with it a little, you'll be in the clear, slashing people all over the place. And you don't even need too much practice. It's a pretty easy weapon to get used to as well. My stats here, 120. Again, we got the 50 skill and 25 arcane set up. I have my runes that boost HP 15 and 10%, as well as boosting my stamina 20% and upping the recovery speed. On the burial blade itself, we got gems that boost physical attack 25.3, 9.8, and 26.3%. We also get a flat arcane boost of 72 points. With the negatives attack versus beast down 11.7 and 11.3. And attack versus kin down 10.3. And by 3, I meant 3 times 3, which is 9. We got a good old blunderbuss, and our armor, the classic black hooded iron helm, Yargol black garb, bone ash gauntlets, bone ash leggings. It looks great. Let's get started with the PvP. And we're going against the saw spear. Got him right in the calf. This calf is no more. We just separated it right from the Achilles tendon. And then we ripped his chest off. <laughs> uh, I, something about the scythe, it just really seems like it's going to rip muscles off. Just the way it digs in and hooks. Could be me. And then we ripped his head off. <laughs> Oh, and he was shoving his butt in there. Oh no, we're going against the flaming bee squad. Got him with a transformation attack. Oh god, <laughs> I was wondering what I was doing. I accidentally switched out the blunderbuss for the fist, which is a much, much worse weapon. Actually, I don't advise anyone to use the fist. It's very bad. Looks like we're going against the saw spear. Oof, that transform attack. Made me want to do one, and then I just transform my weapon. Little failure, but little failure makes us stronger. <laughs> Dang it, I did it again. Oh no. Blast it all. Looks like we're going against the Hunter Axe. And the shield. Missed with our running attack. We both did transformation attacks there. But only mine hit. He got me with his that time. Got him with a little shotgun action. Or the precursor to the shotgun. The blunderbuss. Oh man, that transformation attack. 
Just tore out the innards. Looks like we're going against the Ludwig Blade shield combination. He slapped him in the head. That still didn't take him down to how much health he would have if he would cut it for an even match. But, you know, people don't do it. They can't make him do it. That's a big flaw with Bloodborne. That you're gonna have matches with people that have 30% less health than the other person. Pretty lame overall, but... Oh well. Ah, the electric saw cleaver. I almost said saw spear. Guns. Who brings a gun to a scythe fight? Sure, it's going to be more effective than a scythe. But come on! You electric bastard. against the saw spear. It's been pretty intense so far. Been having trouble keeping track of things to say here. Throwing knife to the arm? What a way to die. Looks like we're going against the Ludwig Blade. He's not falling for my baiting tactics. No one ever does. Got some health restored, that's about it. <laughs> We're getting really close to each other here. He likes those poison knives. You're trying to poison me. Almost hit him with the back step R1. Got him with a couple R1s there. This is the transformation attack. <laughs> this guy is moving all over the place. So much dancing around. <laughs> Finally, we rip his leg off. Good game, sir. Classic dash dart. Feeling each other out. Who will strike first? It was him. Who will hit first? Him. Definitely him. Going against the Hunter Axe. With the shield. Almost hit him with a transformation attack there. He got me with a couple attacks in a row. It looked like he got some iframes on his L2 a little bit. Cause I definitely hit him before he swung at me. But... He's still connected. Wow, got him with an R2. Did a lot of damage. And then an L2 to finish it off. We're going against the Ludwig Blade. 
the shield, and the crow armor. Almost got pummeled by that sword. Luckily we were able to evade it. Now he's going to short sword mode. Or long sword mode, just not just not great sword mode. Oh. Oh boy. Going against the Kirkhammer. The flaming Kirkhammer. Traded hits with the Kirkhammer. Not something you want to do. Ever. When fighting a slower weapon like the Kirkhammer, the L2s are more useful because they have more uh, poise break on them. Wow, looks like we're going against the Flaming Beast Claws. Those things can pack quite a claw. Especially with the fire damage. And I believe he did get his health restored with a message there. So... There's that, but... He's been throwing knives, maybe. Purposely, so I'll hit him. Who knows. Or he could be trying to poison me. <laughs> Got him with the signature scythe hook attack. And once those claws get revved up, they can do quite a lot of chain damage. So I'm glad we didn't get that happening. And a saw spear. What a surprise. Seems that there's no end of saw spheres. Not even a saw cleaver, just all spear. It's a good weapon. I can understand it. <laughs> it's just weird that that's what happened today. Transformation attack for the win. This is Moose Torrent, and I will be back with another video for you guys shortly. Not another repost. Hate this game. Never playing Bloodboard again. Till tomorrow. <laughs>